A litter of golden Labradors will be among the first puppies to graduate as detector dogs from a new customs facility being built near Melbourne Airport. As Chris White tells us, the State of the Art Centre will eventually train 250 law enforcement dogs every year. Brothers and sisters Nina, Nitro, Ninja, Nacho and Nell are the next front line in law enforcement. <laughs> While the pups are cute now, they'll soon grow to be like Astro, detecting drugs, firearms or explosives. Oh my, on it. Now the federal government's building a $25 million breeding and training centre to help the Customs Service keep the country safe. This facility will, uh, by bringing breeding, training and operations together, will make more effective our efforts against terrorism and other risks to our country. The facility will include not only kennels and a veterinarian centre, but also a simulated baggage carousel so the dogs can learn. These five-week-old pups will return to the centre once it opens at the end of the year. They'll be among the first recruits to be trained here. We get to see them from birth right up to actually going out to work and it's almost like they're our babies that are going out and protecting the Australian borders, which is really, really rewarding. Customs breeding program is a world leader, producing almost 2,000 puppies since 1993. We actually help 35 agencies in about 16 countries around the world. All agencies, including like the, the prisons, quarantine, police forces. Awesome. Come Chris White, Nine News.